Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Very excited to show you the Hobonichi unboxing. Um, it's been actually only like six days. I received it yesterday on Wednesday, um, pretty early too. And it was shipped through FedEx. I believe you guys know that maybe, but um, just in case those who doesn't know, it was shipped through FedEx. And um, I got two boxes and one little bag that was um, outside the boxes because I, I guess it couldn't fit in it with the other with the other stuff in this really narrow boxes. But I'm very excited. Um, I just got this really nice pouch uh, that I've been eyeing for actually a couple years now, but I never really got it because. Every time I, s I look at it, I'm like, eh, I don't know about it. <laughs> like, I, I don't know, I don't get really excited about it, but in person, it looks so much different. And it's pretty big, too, pretty large. And compared to, like, my one um, pouch or pen case that I use a lot, um, it's pretty huge. <laughs> and I have tried to put in here a Hobonichi Weeks, so you guys can see how that actually fits in here. It's not meant to be... Or like it's not meant to be a cover or anything like that or, like, or a pouch for your Hobonichi weeks but it's um I just wanted to try it out and I have some um, brush pens here and fountain pens that I tried for you guys so that you can tell you know how big they are or how small they are or what can you fit in it um, but it's pretty handy and I think I will take this one to when I travel because that's a lot of really nice pockets and zippers which is not bad for when you want to put like pens and stuff and you don't want them to like fall off when you open your pouch um, I don't know if you guys have a problem with that but I do <laughs> um, but it's handy so here I'm trying the weeks so you guys can see how that actually looks like and doesn't have doesn't seem like it has a lot of room and it's pretty tight and I only put one week that is barely used so imagine having a week that you're constantly using and it's getting chunkier I don't know how that's gonna close um, so this is the pouch that I bought um, if you guys saw my vlog you noticed that this is not the original pouch that I really wanted to get but um, I do like this one and I've been meaning to get it for a while now and so it was the right moment it felt like the right moment to get it like i feel like okay i can't get the one that i want but at least i get to buy this one which is also another one that i want the texture for this one um the the black and white the gingham how you say that i don't know it feels like a like kitchen cloth or something like that um and it's very like spongy in a way i don't know um, I don't have a problem with the fill of the material. I actually do like it, um, but I thought that was uh, interesting. So look at all the room and pocket in here, like so much space in that little pouch. Um, and so this year I decided to get a Mega Weeks because last year I felt that I used a lot of my um, my back pages which is what notes pages I don't know and I basically I have a couple of them left and it's only because I've been holding on to using them I literally don't use them constantly because I may want to use them for like this week inks and pens videos and so I just want to use it for that but here is the little um I don't know how you call this but I really love it they have all the characters and I love it I actually got like maybe how many do I got of those little envelope not envelopes um I can't remember brochures do we call them bro brochures I really like them they're they're kind of narrow they look nice I kind of like that um so I can't wait to cut them out and put it in my journal because I got a couple of them this year and this is how it looks. Um, I never had a, I never bought, I have never bought a Hobonichi Weeks Mega before. So this looks like a book in a narrow size. It looks amazing. I honestly don't even want to touch it. I just want to look at it and hold it. 
<laughs> they're so good they are the 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 width of it the chunkiness of it looks so nice i i really love chunky hobonichi wigs they look so pretty and it looks like there's so much to to read and tell and in it i just i don't know um so those extra pages in the back are gonna come in handy next year so um I show you here is 217 pages which is crazy because I believe in the week is 120 or was it 60 I don't know <clears throat> yeah, or 90 I can't remember but here's the um, the mother weeks the summer and this one is so gorgeous I'm actually really happy I got the chance to buy this one and I get to show it to you guys this looks so beautiful I like the retro look of this and I love, I don't know what is it about those umbrellas, but they look good with the palm tree and the, even the hotels and the whole buildings in the back. They look super nice, the color they use on this. I really do like it. I think I would definitely use this as my journal, um, but I forgot that last year I thought about using one of the weeks for my budgeting, which right now I'm using it. I'm doing that in my current week. But I wanted to have a separate like planner for that. So I think the mother will be used as a journal, but I'm not 100% sure. So here are all the stickers that comes with this um, Hobonichi Weeks. And I love that there are, they are in, in English so that I can understand what the sign and all that is saying. And um, I, I like them. I want to use them already. I don't know how or what kind of setup I'm going to do, but I'm, I want to use them. So, yeah. Um, exciting. <laughs> and so, this is my next week, which is from the livery fabric, if I'm not mistaken. And I think this is either my second or my third livery fabric weeks that I have bought. Um, I do like the fabric. It's super nice. As you see, it brings like a little clear protector for the back and the front. So I thought that was nice. Um, I, I, I think I noticed that before in my other purchases with this um, style. But um, yeah, and it brings this little card on the back and it talks about, the, I don't know if it talks about the, this fabric particularly or the brand. Um, but it does says about livery fabric, so yeah. And um, yeah, and this is my Hobonichi Techo for 2024. Obviously, we're talking about 2024 planners here, but um, I'm pretty excited that this year I decided to buy another one for next year. I know it's pretty soon to have been to be buying all these planners, and we still have a whole half of the year left. But I'm telling you. It, I've been using them non-stop that I just don't think I don't see like I don't see myself not using this planner next year and I'm always writing something so I know that will come in useful for me so yeah and this is my second box I was super happy when I got two boxes I was like yay too many stuff now I don't know where to put them <laughs> but um uh, I really like that they put everything into boxes and not just like try to leave them outside or anything like they did with the pouch which I don't care much the, about the pouch but paper and and notebooks they do get damaged by water so yeah I did bought uh, just a really regular um, Hobonichi A5 notebook so that I can cut it down later on as the width of the weeks but it's still gonna be as tall as an A5 and then I also, as you can see here, I bought the A5 as well. No covers for this one. And it was the English version. And I think I will buy a cover later on for Moterm because I have my eyes on it on AliExpress. So, yes. And this year, I did buy folders. I think I buy folders once a year, maybe. Um, I mean, not once a year, sorry. Every other year so um, this year I decided to buy this one because I really wish they had is this like I forgot how they call it little gift little remind I don't know um, but 
they I wish they had this edition for the pencil boards because I do love everything in here. I like the Traveler's Notebook in there or the planner in there. I like everything. The colors are so vibrant yet not super vibrant. And the back only has one little um, character in the back which I think is very cute. And so I'm really, really happy about this little folder and I'm definitely going to add them to my um, Hobonichi Techo in my cover. I'm just going to sneak them through it and leave it there. So whenever I need something, <laughs> I could just put it there or put it there or whatever. I can't even speak, sorry. Um, and I got this pencil board. I know this was a cover last year or the year before that. Was it an A5 or an A6? I think it was an A6, but they could have done it for an A5 and I cannot remember. But I really loved the cover. I just I didn't saw myself using this. Um, but <clears throat> any other editions they had come up, any after the signs in the in the past they basically made it as a um pencil board which i wish they did this with any other design they have brought up from the past year because i love this and even so i didn't get to buy them last year as a cover or the year before i get to have a pencil board so i still get to see the design and have it with me and use it in my wigs and in my other planners. So I really, really, really like this pencil board and I was happy I got them this year. And last year I forgot to get this one, so I got that and this one as well for the A5, just because I didn't got them last year. So I wanted to have them this year because I've been using my A5 a lot too. So I wanna have more options for pencil board for A5 since I don't have a lot of options for A5, so. I think they look cute and I did a good job <laughs> and I believe this is my last pencil board and this is for the wigs I really love this red with the yellow and blue and black it looks like just your regular typical color your like primary colors I love it how they did that and the little panda and everything is so adorable it's so cute I really did like this as a wigs pencil board definitely love that I bought this and then, um, I know I talked to you guys about this, but I did bought this little notepads for the weeks and mostly I just wanted to you cut the paper and um, glue them in on my weeks to make it more, look more like a journal than a planner. And I haven't done that yet, but I probably will do that soon. Um, it seems pretty narrow, so I hope it works out. <laughs> but this purchase has it's been nice I, I i also bought this clear cover just in case i decide to put some sticker on my main cover and then put a clear cover on top of that um it's not the only clear cover i have bought but i bought that just as an option and i bought this little pencil pouch or pencil case i love it last year or the year before that i bought a i bought one of this it's a clear one and i use it non-stop i currently um, carry a brush a pencil and a pen and my eraser and it's the most handy thing ever so I'm happy I got to get this one for the 101 donation because I love it and this is the pen for 2024 it reminds me of um, chocolate um, peppermint peppermint chocolate or chocolate peppermint it just reminds me of that so bad and I love it and I love the red the yellow lettering on it I love yellow I really hope they do a yellow pen soon again or an orange pen because I love those colors I know a lot of people don't like them and they prefer the pink and the blue and the baby green but I am more like very vibrant colors I like everything that is not your usual typical stuff so but this ones are really pretty and um i already have a couple of them that I'm, i will be sending to a friend or to a couple of my friends on my instagram
I got this package and I got the one that I wanted. This Naka clock, it looks so cute. When I saw it, I was like, oh, that looks really nice. I like it. But it's, it wasn't my favorite, but it looked really pretty. Um, but <clears throat> the second one that I got was exactly the one that I've been hoping to get for a while. But they are not that big. As you can see, this is an iPhone 11, and I put it right next to it so you guys can see a little bit of a different how it looks and how tall it is. And then this is my second one. How are you today? I love this one. This one I really wanted because I like the the yellow with the green um, things to hold it. I don't know. And the font is so good. It's all about the font, you know. The font just is so good. I love it. How are you today? I love this. It looks very also retro, very vintage. Those are the kind of style that they used to have back then with this really nice font. So I really like the two bags that I got. I have no idea what I'm going to use it for. <laughs> no idea what I'm going to use them for, but I will find a way how to use them. <laughs> but I got the ones that I wanted, so I'm really happy about that. I hope you guys also got the one that you guys were looking for. Um, so here I bought a cover on cover for my A5. Oh, sh A6. <laughs> Sorry. I bought this for my A6 because I felt that this will look really good in my A6. With the cover that I got so this is the cover I got look how pretty don't you guys think it's pretty this cover looks so nice I like the blue outside but mostly I like that yellow inside it looks so good I've been thinking about I uh, did I say yellow sorry orange the orange I've been thinking about orange this whole year I don't know why and a lot of good things have been happening and this has been so many good releases out there and um, many amazing pens and covers and and stationery in yellow in orange I'm kind of like I don't know why I keep saying yellow but but orange and I really really love them and I'm so happy they came out with this interior inside so this is a little side by side um the pen is a bit more darker than the cover the cover is a bit more lighter so just because they look kind of similar in this video doesn't mean it was um in person it really wasn't as like it one was a bit more darker than the cover so yeah but i wanted to give you like uh you know give you a little show so you guys can see for yourself what this color kind of may look like if you don't have a store like me that I can go and look at their releases which I envy you guys <laughs> I envy you guys that you can go to this release um the the release date or not the release date but the reveal dates and I was not be able to do that because I don't have a place where I can just go in and look at my uh, at the Hobonichi new releases but or reveals I don't I don't know what I keep saying but Either way, I put this little bookmarks in the back because one, I don't want them to get dirty, and two, I, I rarely use them. I rarely use them. So here it is. Look how chunky and cute this planner looks. Looks so nice and tiny. As soon as I put this cover on cover, I don't know why. Have you guys? Do you know when when you go to a house and their sofa, they have this clear protector on their sofa so that's what I felt like I was touching that's what I felt like I was holding in my hand it's like a little piece of sofa <laughs> and I don't know I don't know if it's this cover or I don't know if it's just the feel of having this um, clear cover on it but it felt like like I was touching a sofa like I was sitting down in the sofa and all I could touch is the sofa so you can see you can see me just like pressing here and I'm like oh this is a weird different feel um but nevertheless I did like it <laughs> I really did the cover on cover looks super nice and I don't know if I know that I show you guys but the spine is aligned with some of the um images look at that so perfectly I was like wow that looks super good like a book like like as if you had a, an actual spine you know with detail that it was meant to be like that it looks super nice I like it they did a good job doing this whole clear cover 
so yeah guys um i this is basically going to be the end of the video i'm just gonna put the cover and cover on my um my wigs so i can see how it looks and basically i left it like that and i put it away just because i'm not gonna use them anytime soon i i do like to look at them though <laughs> but um i really do hope you guys enjoyed this video and i really do hope you guys enjoy um that i'm sorry that it wasn't more like a real time ish kind of video it's so noisy outside i just don't have the opportunity to turn off my fans and stuff right now i'm, I'm actually not in my own home um, my boyfriend was super nice to let me come into his house and um stay here to do this video so i'm super happy i got a place that i can go that it won't be hot and it will also let me record this voiceover for you guys but i really do hope you guys get your stuff pretty soon and this help you kind of like know what you're getting as well and get you a little bit excited for when you get your own package because i do like watching other people's haul and mostly you um hobonichi hauls so yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and don't forget to give this a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're not and i will see you in the next video okay comment down below what you think and what did you got for next year i'll see you later bye guys god bless you have a wonderful day and take care